Hey guys, how's it going? Alec and Stuff here, and right now Nintendo is hosting a live stream from Gamescom in Europe called Nintendo House Party. And sometime during this live stream, there's going to be some new details regarding Pokemon Sun and Moon. We don't know exactly what they're going to be talking about or how it's going to be revealed, but we do know it's going to happen at some point. Um, right now, they're kind of going through the Battle Royale mode in the new games, so yeah, at some point during the stream, we're going to be seeing some new stuff. Um, with all that said, we're going to go ahead and skip through all the stuff going on right now and just go straight to the good stuff, so I will be seeing you all again really, really soon. Oh, is this... is this it? Is this what we're gonna... Oh, oh, what is this? I wasn't expecting this, they just kind of threw this on screen, oh my god. What is this thing? Fire dragon? What? What? Oh my god, this thing looks brutal! <laughs> oh my god, I was not... they just threw this on screen without any sort of introduction, I swear to you. Holy cow. This thing looks metal! Oh my god! It just blew up! <laughs> or something! What?! What the hell is it?! What?! Alright, so after having watched a little bit more of that stream, that is our news for Pokemon Sun and Moon today. This one Pokemon right here, and his name is Turtonator. He's a fire dragon type and he has an ability called Shell Armor. Um, I was flipping out when I first saw him on stream, man, and I still am. He looks really, really cool. Um, but as a side note, um, as of recording this right now, they have not updated the website with this guy yet, so we really don't know what his ability or move does other than their names. But just from looking at it, I mean, he looks really, really cool. And these battle animations, oh man, after every trailer we see, I'm just more and more excited for this game simply because of how clean it looks. These animations are just really, really good, and his design overall, I mean, I have a feeling that his name was partly inspired by the word Terminator slash, like, kind of kind of mixed with the word Turtle. Um, I, I, as a matter of fact, I'm pretty sure that's where it came from, but yeah, just looking at him, I mean, he looks like a beast. He looks like a real beast, so yeah, that is our news that came out of GameStop to <laughs> GameStop, Gamescom today. Um... Really, really cool stuff. I really hope they keep just hitting us with these Pokemon reveals because I need it. Because I need something to tide me over until this game actually comes out in November. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Ah, but anyways, as always, you know what time it is. I'm Alec and Stuff, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye. <laughs> oh god, I'm such a mess today. This may be the water type gym, as evidenced by several designs of water type Pokemon above some of the building's arches and windows, as well as the giant horsey fountain in the front. Oh, I love that theme, I love their look. They look very... like... like you don't want to mess with them, they look intimidating.